Hello and welcome to your Substance 3D training. My name is Mike Candelo and I am going to be your instructor for this course. So, who is this course for? This course is for anyone who is just getting started in 3D or somebody that already has some familiarity with 3D but wants to learn the Substance 3D tools a little bit more. So what's the goal of this course? The goal of this course is to get you comfortable with creating the 3D assets that you want to create from start to finish, from modeling to texturing to rendering, creating the things that are in your mind, the things that you've always wanted to create. So how are we going to get you there? How are we going to get you comfortable with making your own 3D assets? Well, this course is broken up into a couple of parts. We've got this general introduction where I'm going to be talking about the Substance ecosystem and really just working in 3D in general. The next step is we're going to go through each individual application. We're going to talk about the use cases for them, why you'd use one over the other, and all the how-tos, where are all the buttons located, how do you build certain things, how do you do certain components. From there, we're going to jump into some full workflows. So my goal is to demystify the entire process of creating something from start to finish. So I'm going to show you again and again through a variety of assets and goals, how you create something from beginning to end. So you might be wondering who am I? My name is Mike Canzillo. I'm a 3D artist. I've been doing this for about 15 years. Uh, the majority of that time I spent as a senior artist on animated films with Blue Sky Studios, working on the Ice Age movies, Rio, and a bunch of other ones. I'm also the co-founder of the online school, the Academy of Animated Art. Uh, over the past decade, I've helped hundreds of students I get trained up and get jobs working on animated films. I'm also the co-author of the book Life for Animation, the visual art of storytelling with Jasmine Katakon, where we take you through the whole process of lighting for animated films and some of the artistic principles that go along with that. Over the last couple of years, my career has expanded outside of just 3D animation, and I've begun working with companies like footwear companies, apparel companies, medical visualization, architecture, to introduce more and more people to the world of 3D design. At the time of this recording, I am a 3D artist with Adobe. I work with the Substance 3D team. Uh, my main role is to help individuals and companies get up to speed and used to working with 3D technology. With that in mind, I do have to give a little disclaimer. Uh, all the opinions that I share in this are my own. They are not representative of any company that I work for or any organization that I've been a part of in the past. All right, so with that out of the way, let's jump into the next part, which is we're gonna be talking about the overall world and the 3D pipeline as a whole, as well as the individual Substance 3D tools and how they're used in the creative process.